Hello and welcome back to Monster Hunter Double Cross, where things are looking a little bit different today. I'm not actually wearing different armor, but I have gone and transmogrified my Dino or my Glavinus X into Barioth X because I really like the look of Barioth X. It's nice. Not a huge fan of the big ponytail, but what you gonna do? Either way, today. We are going to be uh, trying to rematch against this here Nakarkos. Because it didn't go so well last time, but I want to bring it down. And I figure I can take a second attempt on camera. Okay, we actually want Defender out of this. Uh, yeah, Lightning Res is good. Oh, game changer. No, it doesn't actually change anything here, but imagining another monster coming to play while we're fighting a Karkos is kind of silly. Oh, um, I've gemmed my equipment so that I don't have a uh, Cap Guru, and instead I've got this uh, uh, Ycademy skill, which is, uh, it's dragon res low, and then some other thing that I don't recognize immediately. But it's the dragon res that I'm here for, because, or that I use it for, because having negative dragon res last time did not work in my favor. So let's see if this Nakarkos goes better than the last one. Also, my armor has more defense. I went and fought enough Hyper Glavinuses to get at least one more upgrade on every piece and was very disappointed to realize that it takes five Glavinous Mantles if you want to fully upgrade the entire set. So, I don't have everything fully upgraded, but I've got three parts fully upgraded. So, yeah. I'm 20 defense behind where I could be, but I'm well above where I had been. There's our pal. So, uh, something I'd like to point out, the fact that you're able to watch this today, if you're watching it the day it came out, is because I'm actually borrowing my old computer from my father. It's the computer that I actually originally started recording things on. So, I know it works. Ow. And, yeah, I don't have my current computer back yet, but this one works. And I'd much rather be able to record than not. So, yeah. But anyway, this does mean that there won't be any interruptions in my schedule. Uh, for those wondering what the hell I'm talking about, if you've been following me on Twitter, you're aware that my computer is actually currently in for repairs, and it's actually not getting repaired, but rather replaced. And I am currently waiting on said re ow, said replacement. And it's looking like it's actually not going to arrive for another week or so. And I'm recording this about three days before it needs to go live. So that should show you what kind of a bind I've been in. Okay, I need to make room for this, and we can get rid of those whetstones. Also, I should actually drink this. Also, hey, four shots in one gather. That is nice. And let's get rid of that Glavinous. Not a fan of the Glavinous skull. Its area of effect is too large. Oh, he is mad. Which means I can get all up in his grill. And he has a laggy skull. 
That's a little dangerously close. Thankfully, he has pushed me out of its way. Thanks, Nikarkos. You're a real pal, sometimes. When you're not murdering my face in with dragon lasers, that is. I feel like it's very important to mention that. Jeez. Did you have to turn all the way this way? I'm just going to go for the attacking right now. Don't have time to get all my gathers, plus I don't have the space for it anyway. I like how Defender kicked in there when that does, like, no damage at all. So let's get all these ballista shots. Okay, can't carry any more. And he's going all red face. So let's toss one of those right in there. And again? Okay. I really don't know what determines when you can and ow, can't do that. I don't know why I'm going for the tentacles. I already know that getting both tentacles does not prevent lasers. Uh-oh. That was close. I'm glad it waited just long enough. Well. Yeah, you do your double hat slam. Okay, we got another knockdown. Those are surprisingly easy to get. And again, I'm just going to go for damage because, again, I don't have the item space for any items gotten from this. Plus, damage is good. It helps us make him dead. There's backbreak number one. Okay, his face is blue, which is annoying, but it also means we're not going to get dragon lasered anytime soon. I enjoy that. Oh, phase one, huh? Hey, we actually got the sharpened. Okay, if we're in phase one, I do believe I'm just going to go here and use up my ballista shots. Ordinarily, I'd use the uh, old ballista shots first. But I expect I'll probably get killed at some point during this fight. And... If that happens, I want to have an empty inventory of regular ballista shots for the simple reason that there are 10 more of them waiting in the item box. Ow. Okay. So let's go ahead and grab some health here. We need it. Uh-oh. Well, that's not so bad. So the fact that I flinched it and it immediately brought the tentacle back... Did I break one? Without realizing it? Ow. That's... No, I did not. They're both around. I saw the one next to the icon and wasn't thinking, hey, that means that it's just that's the first one that it wants us to target. For whatever reason, my brain was thinking, oh, that means there's only one. But hey, that's definitely a break. Uh-oh. Ow. G-Rank Nakarko's hurts. Let's not get caught up in this. Okay, now we've actually got health, which is good. I enjoy having health. I use it to stay alive. Grabbing more shots, just so that I can shoot them. It's kind of what you do with ballista shots. It's their reason for existing. 
Okay. Okay. Need to go farther. Okay. We were actually almost totally fine where we were. So, can I trust him to hold still while I... Nope. Need to make sure he's got another target that he's going for if I'm going to be trying to bomb his hat. Looks like I'm fine now, though. Don't roll me into the goo. Okay, good. And let's make a couple more. I don't have too many, but it's enough to cause some damage. I would much rather be hit by my own bomb than by his. So I'm totally cool with what just happened there. Okay. And let's make one last one, though we're not using it just yet. He does not want us doing that. Okay, we need to, whoop. We need to kill that second tentacle so that we can get the knockdown we want. And we need to do it before he gets tentacle, the, the other tentacle back. And hey, it was one hit away. That's fine by me. That is aces. So let's get in here and do damage to his rainbows. All right. And looks like we are going back to phase two. But that's fine, because phase two is more interesting and has better music. Wow, you really like yelling, don't you? Did the yell to say, hey, I'm getting in phase two? The yell to enrage, and then, I don't know, just another yell because he felt like it? Maybe there were only two yells. I wasn't paying too much attention. I just know that there was more than one. Thankfully, he stopped being enraged in time for me to actually be able to use that Sonic. Unfortunately, it looks like he's probably getting some special skulls right on back. Oh, he, he swapped Glavinus for Bracky. That is not improvement. Ow. I considered getting... Uh, Bio Researcher, so that I could be immune to Blast Blight and thus not have to care too much about the Bracky Skull. But I figured with his ability to kill me from 120 HP with the uh, Dragon Lasers, I should probably focus on at least not having negative Dragon Res. And thus, my decision was made to get the White Academy skill. Because, yeah, death by dragon lasers from 120 HP, not my favorite. Okay, we broke his Uragon skull. That's good for us. And there goes that tentacle. Even better. Because now, we can get in here and do the real damage. Problem is, when he wants to do that, I don't have much I can do as a countermeasure. Looks like he... Oh, that was close. Okay. Um, where's the ballista? It's over there. That's not far. So, I think now is a good time for a binding. Okay, what happens if I do break this? I know I'm doing less damage by going for it, but I'm still doing decent damage, judging by the size of the uh, blood splashes. So... Doing decent damage and getting myself a benefit 
of him having no tentacles for a moment could be well worth my while. But now he's probably going to have both tentacles back when he pops up. Yep. I don't know that I've ever killed both tentacles in a phase two situation. I usually just go for his face when it's open and then get his helmet to drop down on my face. Speaking of his helmet, I just got a break on it. And a break on his face. Though I think there might be some lasers coming soon. So I'm going to go ahead and not be directly in front of anything. Yeah. Yeah, when he gets distance and he's all red, I get a little bit worried. Ow. Ooh, good flinch. That's a knockdown flinch, too. So this time I actually am gonna... Ooh, got a gem. And a better gem. And the same better gem. Okay. Uh, it's Nakarko's soul orb is what the high rank one is, right? I don't rightly recall... Yeah, that was, that was good mining. About as good as one could hope. Okay, I need to get one of these tentacles all busted up. There we go. Face no longer blue. And let's not get pounded by that Aragon. And let's work to bust this tentacle. Well, got rid of the Aragon. So at least we're not dealing with that. Ooh, flinches galore. And there's the break. So what does that do for me? Seems like it just makes him not have tentacles for a little while. I mean, that's not bad. It's just not what I was hoping for. I was hoping for some kind of super knockdown that leaves his face exposed. That would have been amazing. But no, it seems I've caused him to want to slam his hat down a lot, which is objectively worse than him having a tentacle if I'm trying to be in his face. Okay, bye. Okay, let's get some ballista shots. He's going all red in the face. We can't carry any more ballista shots. Okay, what was that flash? I, I do not like these things that you do, Nakarkos. Oh, hey, got a flinch off of his uh, face tentacle. Just incidentally. I'm totally down with incidental flinches. Oh, ow. Ooh, good, got the break. Good job, cat. Okay, I'm going to get a little bit of health here. And then I'm going to toss this into his mouth. Okay, that, that accomplished nothing. I really do need to learn just when you can and cannot do the things that are tranks in his face. Also, I need to actually use these anti-dragon bombs that I only just remembered I had when I swapped over to them. Got them both on. 
Excellent. He did not enjoy that. And I can't blame him. I wouldn't enjoy it either. I'm glad he's going over there and not over here. It is weird that he can have a broken tentacle just hanging out like that. I should really take a closer look at that, because, I mean, how often do you get to see it? Can it be broken again? These are things that I want to know. It can be flinched. Oh, it flinching it got it a skull back. What? Is that a bug? Getting to see it without a skull? Because I can't imagine it's intended if flinching it causes it to have a skull again. Maybe if I left it without getting it flinched, it wouldn't have been able to get a special skull. That would have been nice. I would have loved that. Ow. 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 A carcos. That is not nice. I do not appreciate you smashing the life out of me. I don't know how much health I had before I died, but I'm sure it wasn't too small. Do I have a sub? We do. Okay, it's to break his left and right tentacles? His left and right something. We've already broken both tentacles before, so I guess there must be another break. In which case, that's pretty cool. And I suppose I should work towards it. I'm not entirely certain it's tentacles, because, like... All I'm certain of is the left and right thing. And I can't imagine what else he's got left and right of. So, what's he doing with those hands? Oh. Let's, let's be on the side that doesn't have a special skull. Even though that means it's the side that can do dragon lasers. Like that. Oh, hey. The laggy one broke when it slammed down. Is there a reason for that? There's a lot of things I don't know about G-Rank Nakarkos. And they might not even be exclusive to G-Rank Nakar, because it might just be changes they've made because of Monster Hunter Double Cross. For all I know, some of these changes could apply to High Rank Nakarkos as well. I really do need to do more research. Well, there is a break. He has got his hat way up. Okay. Okay, I... He's got slime dribbling out of that tentacle. Yeah, I think it's meant to just be a bug, because I'm pretty sure he was just supposed to have a bracky skull there. Okay, let us very much not get hit by that. That is uh, to be avoided at all costs. Maybe we need to get both tentacles in that skullless state at the same time for the sub. Yeah, I think that'll be it. Because that one at least looks skullless. Though it may not actually be. What causes it to be like that? No, no, don't, don't put your hands under. 
Yep, now he's got a uh, naked Glavinus. Oh boy, I, I don't like that Aragon Skull. I don't like it one bit. We've, we've had problems very recently. I, I want it gone. Can it be gone? Way to try the hat slam when I'm not in range. Okay. Got rid of the Uragon skull. There we go. Now there's no skulls. So. Ooh. Okay. It still acts like it's got a Glavina skull, and I didn't want to gather that. I wanted to use my hunter art. There we go. Whoa. Close there. Okay. Here's what we're going to do. We're go okay, he's he's going to go somewhere. Where where are you going? Okay, there he is. And he's got skulls back. Yep, I have no idea what any of this means. Other than if he makes the mistake of getting close. Uh oh. Nope. Please make the mistake of getting closer. That's that's farther. Okay. He's scooting over this way. This works. I'm just gonna get all up in that face. That's what you should do when he's bound anyway. Because his face is soft and often dangerous to be in front of. Ooh. Time to get on up and get smacking his rainbows again. Why does Defender always kick in for that? It does, like, no damage. It's the least useful time to have Defender kick in. So, since he is not in a red phase right now, I'm just going to go ahead and use all this Ballista ammo. Because it's damage, it's fairly rapid, and it lets us grab more. So, ooh, ooh, I threaded that needle. Okay, now he's red again. So now I care once again about being at a distance. And I certainly don't want to be at a distance where I take those lasers point blank. Or at the point where they cross, because, uh, being at the point where they cross got me killed before. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> okay. Being able to panic dive is good. I'm glad I haven't had a reason to use my deodorants yet. I brought them because, I mean, Ariel has a bit of a problem with rolling off Blast Blight. So figured, hey. I can make it so that I don't have to roll it off. I imagine it's slightly faster, slightly, to just, ow, put away my weapon and then use a deodorant. Provided I've already got it close to where I am in my inventory. Uh-oh. Okay. 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 I don't think the beam will come this far over. Okay. Again? Okay, not again. He just, he flashed and started being covered with dragon element. How do you, how do you feel about tranks? You don't. 
Okay. Yes, again. Okay. I'm I'm just gonna be over here playing with your tentacle. Oh good, you're sweeping the other way. That is that is excellent. Do that every time. I promise you I won't complain. Still gotta find a time to use that other bomb. And I'm out of binders. Which is unfortunate. But that's the way things go sometimes. And he is going red again. He's going red a lot lately. Is is this him trying to tell us that he's almost dead? I hope so. Because if he's almost dead, that means I've almost won. I mean, that's, that's just kind of how this game works. I've been tasked with killing him, so... Ah! 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 I almost rolled into that. I do not like rolling into things like that. It is uh, not among my top five favorite things to ha happen. Neither is that. But, admittedly, I'll take that over rolling into a dragon laser. Okay, we're doing fine on health thanks to the cat. Though, then again, this Uragon tentacle has proven that to be false multiple times. Um, that, that red dragony flash, does that mean, no, it does not. Oh boy, it's laser time again, and I can't get behind this tentacle. Do not sweep this way, do not sweep, the oh, he's sweeping this way, dive! Okay. <laughs> uh, that was not a good position for me. He's lasering a lot. I I imagine this does mean he is nearly dead. But I also imagine it means I am very worried. We've gotten both face breaks. That's good. Still. Uh, seriously, another way? Oh, he's dead. We did it. Didn't get the sub, though. But hey, we killed a G-Rank Nakarkos, and we did much better than last time. Because I knew some things to avoid. I didn't avoid all of them, of course, but I avoided some of them. Enough of them, really. Still wish I got the sub, though. Not sure what you gotta do in order to get it. Someone who's better at reading Japanese than I am probably knows. But... That's not me. So yeah. Is left and right something Yeah, I I can't even imagine how all that is read. I know one of the four or five kanji involved. So that's certainly not enough. Oh, hey, another high rank soul orb. Well, that is going to be it for this episode. Join us next time when we fight another creature that n has never existed until this game. See you then, friends. <laughs>